Hey everyone, Dr. Bart here. In a moment, I'm gonna show you how to heal up your plantar fasciitis. So this can be super uncomfortable. Some of the signs and symptoms, typically you wake up in the morning, put your feet on the ground and you have lots of pain. And it seems like the more that you do, the more pain you have. Then there's a lot of treatments out there that oftentimes are very ineffective. We stretch it, we roll it, we dig at it, we use foam rollers at it, maybe even worse, steroid shots, and even sometimes surgeries. So for the moment, I'm going to tell you to put all of those things aside for just a moment, and I'm going to introduce a couple different therapies that you can do that are very effective. We'll get great results in our office, although they may seem like they're almost counterintuitive the way we're going to go about it. So real quickly, here's, here's how it looks. I'm going to take my shoe off to do this. You need to just sit in a nice, comfortable position like this, cross, cross your legs up. And what we're going to do is we're going to stretch a muscle called your tibialis anterior. It attaches up in your knee, in the lateral aspect of your knee, and it goes all the way down and attaches on the medial side of your foot. If this muscle gets tight, it binds everything up, and a lot of times that is the cause of your plantar fasciitis. So what we're going to do is we're going to stretch this muscle out. And real simple, we're going to grab onto our foot, and we're going to pull, and we're going to lengthen this muscle. And what we're going to do, we want to be able to feel it. We're going to pull it pretty good, and we're going to stretch the ankle and into this tibialis anterior. We're going to pull and hold. I'm gonna pull and hold. You can do that 10 times. I'm gonna recommend you do it to both legs. Very good chance that the other side is that's tight and sometimes you don't have the plantar fasciitis, but it might be on its way. So you're gonna make sure you do that at least two times a day. And now with that being said, before you do this, make sure that before you even start this treatment, make sure that you take time out and rate your pain that you're currently in. Maybe you're in a seven or an eight or nine or 10 out of pain. This is a nine out of 10 in pain. This is real important because once you're done, do 10 of these guys, pull and hold, pull and hold, stretch and hold, stretch and hold. And the moment you're done, stand back up, move your feet around and re-rate it. The likelihood you're gonna immediately have a pain reduction because you can create more space for that fascia. If we're always digging and poking and prodding at the actual plantar fasciitis, it's likelihood that you're gonna create more little micro tears and keep it inflamed nonstop. We see that often. All right. The second thing I'm going to introduce to you can be absolutely phenomenal, especially if you can bring it in together. And that's what we call sound wave therapy. Some of you may have access to some of this, some of you may not. So I'll just introduce it real quick. What sound wave therapy will do, will send a sound wave into those tissues where they're inflamed, where there's some extra scar tissue built up, where they're not moving as well. And it in instantly will start to increase the vascularization in that area. And we know that the more vascularization that we have, we have more blood, nutrients, oxygen, hormones to heal the area. So one of the most phenomenal, successful techniques or therapies that I've used in clinic, and if you have access to it, if you don't, the other technique will work. If you combine the two, you'll probably increase the rate of your healing by at least two times. All right, with that being said, hopefully that's gonna help you out in, in getting yourself to heal through plantar fasciitis. Try this out, do it for at least two weeks two times a day, I almost promise you or guarantee you, you're gonna get some great results. All right, that being said, make sure you take deliberate action today for your mind, your body, your overall wellness, y'all be awesome.